What's going on, rock stars? This is Jen. We're going to be doing the rhythm guitar for When It Rains by Paramore, one of my favorite songs. Um, let's talk about the tuning first, please. This is in E flat tuning. So we have E flat, A flat, D flat, G flat, B flat, E flat. Very, very important if you want to play um, to the song. Because if you don't tune it that way, if you have it in standard tuning, it's going to be a half a step off. So another important thing to note is that when I say the chord names, it's relative to where they are on the neck. I'm going to be saying this is a C sharp minor, which is not actually a C sharp minor, but it's the shape on the neck and that's how most of us guitar players talk. We don't really take into consideration if there's a capo, you know, if there's a capo on the third fret, we'd still say this is a G even though it's a B flat and uh, so on and so forth. Tune down, we're still going to call this a C sharp minor even though it's not. I know that drives some of you crazy, but uh, that's what we do. I, I'm here just to drive you crazy. So, end of story, the end. <laughs> so, let's get into it. Not so bad. It starts with a C, uh, C sharp minor here on the fourth fret and it's got that delay which I don't have delay unfortunately so but you just hit it once you got what I'm saying I'm gonna get in trouble for this I can already tell and then it goes into the intro which is actually the same as the chorus but let's talk about it we're gonna do A sus 2 to C sharp minor 7 which actually it's a power chord, but we keep these two strings open, the, the E string and the B string, which is now E flat and B flat, yes I know. Um, keep that open, then we go to B, no, we don't go to B yet, we don't go to B yet, we do. C sharp minor seven, then we go to E. Same thing, keep these open, but it's still an E5 chord. A sus two, two. Now, B sus four, keep these two open, C sharp minor seven. So here's how it sounds. Now we're going to end on an open position E chord right there. Now what did I do for this strumming here? Down, down, up, 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 down, up. Down, up, down, up. I think that's what I did. I think that's what you should do. I think so. So now we get into the verse. Uh, C sharp minor seven. Hold it out, whole notes. Three, four, stay on there. Da, 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 da. A sus two, open position E. Repeat that, C minor seven. C sharp minor seven, I'm sorry. One, two, three, four. A sus two, to open position E. Now we're gonna do F sharp minor 11. The key to this is you do an, like an F sharp five chord. You have to mute this G string or it's gonna be awful. And then keep these two, the B and the E, open. Don't hit that G, I'm telling you. I do it all the time, it's bad. Hang out there, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. This is our pre-chorus, open position E. F sharp minor 11. Now you go to open position E. Now B sus4. That's our pre chorus. And then back into, or then we go into the chorus, which is the same as the intro, which is the A sus2, C sharp minor 7, E5, A sus2, B sus4, C sharp minor 7. Now the only thing left is the bridge. Uh, which is very simple because you've gotten through most of the chords. The bridge, F sharp minor 11. Try to arpeggiate these top notes because they sound so pretty. So bar of F sharp minor 11 to open position E. A sus 2. Now we're going to do E over G sharp, which is very, very, very nice. So I have my third finger on the fourth fret sixth string, I have my first finger on where do I have it? On the second fret fourth string, and then I have my pinky here on the third fret, I'm sorry, the third string fourth fret. 
and that's a quick change. And then we got one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two. Now change. So there we go. E over G sharp. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now we're gonna go to a D sus two for the end for those hits. It's one, two, and three, four, one, two. And then we have the outro, which is not so bad at all. F sharp minor 11, hold a whole note, two, three, four, E in open position, two, three, four. Do those same hits that you did on the D sus two, on the A sus two. One, two, and three, four. And I'm doing down, up, down. And just let it ring. And that is all of uh, guitar one, your rhythm guitar for when it rains. Um, I'm going to be doing lead guitar right now. Uh, there should probably be a link to the lead guitar part, which I'm sure my producer Mark will put up there for you. Uh, if you have any questions about this song, please let me know. Make sure to get that tuning happening. Um, you can find us on Facebook now, Mahalo Guitar Lessons. You can find me on Facebook. Please uh, rate, comment, and subscribe for these videos, and we very much appreciate your support. and. Uh, that's all for me for today. Okay. Ah. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. To learn more songs, check out these videos. To learn more guitar, go to mahalo.com slash play guitar.